Hello, my name is Jed Bublington, and I'm sad because I'm just a nothingist. I'm not the anythingist at anything. Ever since I was a little boy, I just wanted to be the best somethingist somewhere. But all I'm good at is being a nothingist. And even that I'm not the best at. Jack Hoggins Higgins is the best nothingist at our school. When we go outside for lunch, he just stands in the corner, counting the nothing pass. But I don't want to be a nothingist. I don't like corners and I don't like counting. I like eating and Jack never seems to want to eat. Jack never seems to want to anything. Oh well. I've tried to be a somethingist, I really have. I wanted to be the best climber. But Peter is a better climber than I am. Besides, heights rather frighten me. I tried being the best writer, but my hand cramped up and I got writer's block. Then I tried being the worst writer, but there are so many bad writers. It was too hard. I could have been the best cook in the world but my parents won't let me in the kitchen since I gave them salmonella. It would have been nice to be the best musician, but my music teacher said that I could barely tell the difference between a G minor 7 and a C major 6. I thought about being a scientist, but scientist ends with the letters I, S, T, and not E, S, T. <coughs> Which means it has nothing to do with being the anythingist at all. I decided to be the most resourceful crime fighter in town. But I got trapped in a peninsula of caution tape. Dying. I tried being the most social. Oh. Taisha Turpentine has more friends. I tried being the least social, and my parents made me go to a psychiatrist. I thought it would be great to be the oldest man in the world. But I got impatient and decided that that was not the job for me. Then I tried to be the tallest man in the world. But I'm not very good at walking on stilts. So instead I tried to be the shortest man in the world. But I didn't want to saw off my own legs, and my parents wouldn't help me. Darn it. I wanted to be the anythingist. The anythingist at anything. The best anything in the whole world of anythings. Oh well. But wait! It doesn't matter if I'm the anythingist at anything. I'm the everythingist at everything me. There are better writers. Worse ones too. There are better climbers and cooks, singers and scientists. There are taller men, shorter men, older men, and babies too. But none of them act quite the peculiar way that I do. Maybe one day I'll be an anythingist. But today, I'm happy just to be me.